Oh hello welcome back to my youtube channel so guys there is a company that is really really trending right now it is um, it's being discussed a lot a very small company called winko venture and you will see if you take a look at what is going on reddit and and uh, all the other social platform pretty much this one is actually pretty hot right now and this way i am making a video so guys to governmental uh, governmental agency and uh, hospitals and distributors interest um, interesting company here but uh, we don't want to see what's the fuse about this company and uh, if we take a look at the stock news you will uh, you will kind of see what is happening here here's what uh, what to, to watch for wink adventure uh, stock after trade resumption and you uh, send the stock soaring and tip penny stock to buy it now this is a penny stock pretty much as as nearly a dollar and the stock stores higher as trending resume and you will see here we can always take a little bit of a look at the news and see what happened winko venture negotiated its long term downtrend which will which we will examine and a little bit later but hasn't yet confirmed a new app trending is in the stock is in need of longer term sideways consolidation above the dollar one level as you will see here right here now what happened here is what we want to see pangins gas uh, these followers on twitter and what stock they are zero uh, is on this week and uh, a lot of the answer uh, were about uh, winko van uh, winko adventures it uh, it looks like uh, which resumed the trending on uh, uh, august pretty much uh, uh, after being halted for nearly two weeks after additional information was requested from the company by the nasdaq stock market and uh, when they hold lifted in at uh, uh 12:30 pm the stock began to show uh, really more than 50% of the open as you can understand probably investor or i should say traders for the more uh, for the most part we are thinking that uh, nothing really went wrong here and uh, this is why we are looking at a higher stock price people uh, piled up and uh, piled in on the stock so prior to the whole twin uh conventions announced that july 25 the termination of ceo lisa king uh, here and uh, some of the other executive as well the as well the day before the hold was lifted wing um, winko ventures announced and uh, and as a uh, as you will see here a massive increase in trending volume here winko ventures during the four trading days following the hold uh, begin lifted which caused the stock to try to locate a total of uh, 158% between these dates over here now as you can uh, as you can understand this uh, this company is interesting definitely very very interesting especially when you are hearing about a uh, potential uh, tiktok competitors uh, you know your eyes become a lot of machine potentially but we we do not to want to examine uh, what they have been doing and what they are doing right now is it an uh, an interesting pie is the thing now you could always be thinking that okay this may be worth a, a try and maybe uh, you can hold for a long term and kind of bet on its uh, potentially become the next tiktok who knows the price of free cash flow are very very negative uh, here and uh, you will notice that uh, taking a uh, taking a look at the net income uh, that they had a pretty horrible year pretty much in 2022 and uh, outstanding sales they have been uh, going uh, going upward because you know as the people uh, were piling in on the stock the company actually thought that is uh, that is a good idea to take some profits and lease Uh, you extra sales and uh, make some money off this huge jump over here which makes a ton of sense like you can see the, the whole thing here every year start and this makes a ton of sense i mean if uh, if i were an executive in the company i would uh, probably do the same cause i wanted uh, i would want to get some money out of the moment the price movement of the stock it makes uh, a ton sense uh, but uh, 
it doesn't really invest so this is a horrible thing as you can understand because the because you know the flow the outstanding sales has been jumping tremendously and it's a pretty terrible here you have been diluted massively as an investor basically your sales have become practically speaking almost portal share so this is a this is a really bad for a long term investor in this way that totally that the total library has been growing of course because of this extra sale but other than that everything else in the company doesn't look nice and even the revenues going down which are very 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 bad factors to go to account for especially the revenue growth is pretty bad to see that is actually uh, actually going negative right so guys um, you don't want to see that uh, from a company this is not making money of course now now remember that we are in an environment where everything every company pretty much going to have some slumps some days some quarters potentially but it's not going to be down uh, going to be doing well because of what uh, what is happening in the market and so this is not a defin definitive factors uh, of the uh, revenue is down for me not not to be buying this company now so guys uh, now the data they have compared to to equity is not high but remember they got a lot of equity because actually they were making money selling selling sales so that uh, that's how they have so so much but again in in terms of what they are doing of their returns here uh, like you will see a high returns on equity from where the company did make a little bit of money here but overall things are not really looking great in terms of financial and uh, and uh, you will kind of see it over here in the uh, income statement for intense but the company has been generally speaking kind of sort of like growing the revenue although uh, for the last year has been a little bit bad but again this can happen uh, it uh, doesn't really worry me too much frankly one year uh, on or a few quarters is um, not like a definitive uh, thing what is a little bit more actually actually bad hair uh, bad hair and uh, what i should what i uh, i should i sh should say is the fact that the meeting was actually very very negative over uh, here in 2022 which wasn't a great year for the company again this can happen but uh, this kind of losses can accumulated uh, rather uh, rather quickly here and uh, you will see that the current of the level of the company is uh, is not very high as well sitting at the 153 million so i am wondering whether the company will keep on measuring shares although uh, right now they should probably stop that because the price of the stock has plummeted and one of the factors why the pressure of the stock has plummeted is that is definitely the extra share that have been printed no no doubt about that so they come and take a look of look at this one take a look at the moment of the additional paid in capital and was added here because of the combination of sales so this is absolutely and in terms of the cash flow statement you will notice here but uh, yeah we are we are very in the negative for over here and uh, after the all the adjustment we are still seeking our negative free cash flow not uh, not horribly negative but uh, still pretty negative as you will see so guys thank you for watching my video